Under the silver sheen of the moonlight, the battlefield lay draped in an eerie stillness. Shadows danced across the undulating terrain, casting haunting silhouettes of fallen soldiers and shattered remnants of war machines. The air was heavy with the weight of unspoken sorrow, each breath a solemn reminder of the sacrifices made on this hallowed ground. The moon, a silent witness to the carnage below, bathed the scene in its ethereal glow, lending an otherworldly quality to the desolate landscape. Amidst the vast expanse of darkness, punctuated only by the occasional flicker of distant torches, the battlefield seemed to hold its breath, as if mourning the lives lost in the tumult of battle. The moonlight, filtered through the canopy of trees, painted a melancholy picture of devastation and despair, casting long, twisting shadows that seemed to reach out and embrace the fallen. It was a scene of profound solemnity, where even the stars seemed to weep for the fallen heroes who now rested beneath the earth. As the moon's luminous rays cascaded over the battlefield, they unveiled a tragic tableau of death and destruction. Amidst the silent chaos, a fallen cavalry horse and its rider lay entwined in a macabre embrace, their forms swollen and distorted by the merciless hand of war. The horse, once a proud steed, now lay motionless, its majestic form reduced to a grotesque monument of the violence that had ravaged the land. Beside it, the rider, stripped bare by the brutality of battle, bore the scars of their final struggle, a silent testament to the harrowing toll exacted by war. The sight of the fallen horse and rider served as a stark reminder of the human cost of conflict, a poignant symbol of the sacrifices made in the name of duty and honor. Their lifeless forms, illuminated by the moon's uncertain light, spoke volumes of the tragedy that had befallen them their silent presence haunting the battlefield like ghosts of a bygone era. In their death, they embodied the courage and resilience of those who had fought beside them, their sacrifice a somber reflection of the price paid for freedom and justice. As the news of the fallen cavalry horse and its riders spread throughout the camp, a palpable sense of sorrow descended upon its inhabitants. Faces once filled with camaraderie and laughter now bore the weight of grief each heart heavy with the burden of loss. The somber atmosphere was punctuated by whispered conversations and solemn nods of acknowledgement, as soldiers and civilians alike grappled with the harsh reality of war's toll. Yet, amidst the sea of sorrow, there burned a flicker of determination, a resolute resolve to honor the fallen and press onward in the face of adversity. In the midst of despair, a collective strength emerged, binding the camp's inhabitants together in a shared sense of purpose. Though tears were shed and hearts were heavy, there was an unwavering commitment to carry on the fight, fueled by the memory of those who had given their lives in service to a greater cause. It was a testament to the resilience of the human spirit, as even in the darkest of times, hope remained steadfast and unyielding. And so, with sorrow in their hearts and determination in their souls, the camp's inhabitants stood united, ready to face whatever challenges lay ahead in their quest for peace and justice. Amidst the somber stillness of the camp, a flurry of activity unfolded as the inhabitants rallied to tend to the wounded and honor the fallen. Medical tents sprang up like fragile blossoms amidst the desolation, their canvas walls a beacon of hope in the darkness. Within their confines, healers worked tirelessly to staunch bleeding wounds and ease the pain of the injured, their hands guided by a mixture of skill and compassion. Meanwhile, burial details fanned out across the battlefield, their solemn task made all the more poignant by the moon's gentle glow. With each fallen comrade laid to rest, a chorus of prayers and solemn hymns rose up, a final tribute to lives cut short by the cruel hand of fate. In the face of overwhelming grief, the camp's inhabitants drew strength from one another, their collective effort a testament to the power of unity in times of adversity. Shoulder to shoulder, they worked tirelessly to ease the suffering of the wounded and ensure that the fallen were granted a dignified farewell. Each task, no matter how small, was imbued with a sense of purpose and meaning, a solemn reminder of the bonds that united them in their shared struggle.
And as the last shovel of earth was cast upon the final resting place of the fallen, a sense of closure descended upon the camp, tempered by the knowledge that their sacrifices would never be forgotten. From the depths of despair arose a beacon of resilience and hope, illuminating the path forward for the weary inhabitants of the camp. Inspired by the courage and sacrifice of their fallen comrades, they found within themselves a newfound determination to carry on the fight. With hearts heavy yet spirits unyielding, they pledged to honor the memory of the fallen by pressing onward in their quest for peace and justice. Guided by the flickering flame of hope, they embraced the challenges that lay ahead, knowing that their resolve could withstand even the darkest of nights. In the shadow of tragedy, they stood united, their spirits unbroken by the trials they had endured. And as they gazed towards the horizon, they saw not just the fading light of the moon, but the promise of a new dawn, a testament to the indomitable human spirit and the enduring power of hope. Thanks for watching, guys, and don't forget to subscribe Antiquity Scope.